superstar right here. This is Gavin Styles. Yours truly here. And I've been giving you the great privilege to give you all your news, rumors, headlines, and updates on all the EBW superstars by the general manager. So you know something? I'm also going to be conducting interviews, which I'm not... Eh, I'm a little bit of this on it about my first guest because... Well, you'll see him for yourself. Really? You don't even have the respect to say the champ's name? Well... I'll introduce myself then. Um, I am RJ, the EBW champion. I have been out a little bit because I did separate my rotator cuff, but I mean, I think the reason he didn't introduce my name is he's still a little butthurt about me beating him for this belt. I mean, I've beaten you, I've beaten you on occasions before. I've beaten B-Dog, I've beaten T-Bone, I've beaten all of them. You beat me once. Beat him so three it times. was an I quit match, I beat your ass, and I'm gonna do it again when I come back. I'm in that championship. Are you? Yeah, I am. Do you really think that, Gavin? Yes, I do. Okay. So, uh, you don't have the respect for these people because you're sitting on your ass and you're not even standing up. So, I mean, uh, it's a little bit of Gavin, arguing. I'm talking. Okay. So, All right. are you implying that you don't have a match tonight? I don't know if I do. I don't know. The general manager never really tells me. He puts me through you. So... Do I have a match? If I do, then I'll take out whoever you want me I to mean, take out. I'm going to give you a match tonight. All right. I'm going to be the special guest referee. And if you do get in the way, I'm going to take you out again. So I'll do that. And Gavin, let's tell them the truth. Isn't it a true story that I've heard in the locker room that you got a knock on your locker room door and you opened it and they wanted an autograph? But not from you. It was from me. But I was injured and out, so they couldn't give it to you. Ooh. I heard that was a true story, and I heard you got pretty hurt about that. So you know I have some followers, and I have some people who do like me. And because of that, you're a little mad that I probably took some of your fans when I beat you. I have all the respect of these people, hopefully, and I have all the respect in the world for them. So you know something? I wouldn't stand here and stop talking the crap on a whole bunch of people because tonight you're putting that title on the line on the special guest referee. You're going one on one with the returning B Dog. Right. And hope and it's gonna be an extreme hardcore brawl match. Here's, outside. Here's my problem though. Isn't RJ the one or B Dog the one that kind of helped me beat you? I mean, yeah, because you couldn't do it on your by yourself. Gavin, I put you out by myself. I didn't have help the second time I beat you. The first time you know, I got help beating you because you got help using fire. Oh, uh, it was an I quit match, dummy. You can use anything to your advantage to make your opponent say the words I quit, and I made you say the words I quit. But here's the thing. But you had your little camera we guy and referee B Dog know. put the fire out for you. We both know, Gavin, that the reason you used fire is you have to be honest about this, is because you know you couldn't put me out by yourself. Alright. You know that you could not put me out with your hands, your moves, your finishers. Because I am too strong. Do you, you really out. think that you're going to be able to beat B-Dog tonight? I'm not implying that you can't. I'm not implying that B-Dog can't beat you. But you know something? You're going to really get a little bit of softened up power because B-Dog is going to hopefully get his hands on you. And he even told me that he wanted a piece of you because he told you he's, he told me he's sick of the way that you've been treating him. I've been treating him pretty bad. That is true. Because I've been out. I was cranky that I was out. I don't want to be out just like you. You don't want to be out. But... Let's let's be honest. Being out of business is not the funnest thing. But I am better, stronger, quicker, harder. So either way, I'm going to win tonight. Oh, you want to know something? What? It's it's a manality because you're not gonna be. Hopefully, you're not gonna be able to get past B Dog. And you know something? If you do, then you keep your championship. I'm I'm gonna keep my championship. Just like when I beat you for it. I beat you for this belt multiple times because you kind of can't keep it. So why don't you just come over here and look. Get up. Come on, Gavin. You're the special guest referee. Count one, two, three. How about I take you out for the first ten seconds, huh? Gavin. You can't beat me. You never could. You never will. You beat me once. End of story. And that's how I'm going to leave today. The champ, just like I am now. I'll see you in my match. When really all it is is a puppet show, I'm going to lead it.
is an EBW. Extreme Hardcore Brawl. Introducing first, he is the challenger. He is the returning B Dog. He's ready for this EBW Championship match. And his opponent, he is the current EBW Champion, RJ. Man, I don't know why she's here. Oh, oh sh! And a good takedown. Oh, punches right to the face. You better watch it, buddy. Oh! Right to the back of the uh. No, not the shovel. Oh, right to the side of the head and neck. Stomp right onto this. Oh, keep going for the right. Oh. Punches right to the face. Oh! The right to the side of the room. You give beat all of you, okay? Drop kick right to the midsection of RJ and beat all back up. He's ready to take this championship. Oh, and another one. Oh. He's like, you get a more straight on the kick pad right to the head of B Dog. This is getting kind of extreme to shake him off. Oh no. That death like, oh! Right on the two bone. Oh, right into the edge of the pool. Eat all you give. Why? Oh no, he's dunking his head right in the water. Oh, what a super kick! Right to the back of the leg. Ah. Oh! You're not medically clear? I mean, you're going... How's your collarbone, RJ?
Break to the collarbone. Oh, oh no. He, it looks like he's got the advantage. Looks like B-Dog hasn't done enough damage yet. No. Oh, what an uppercut. Right to the bridge of the chin. B-Dog doesn't look like he's doing so good. Oh no, where's he going now? Where's he going? Right over the fence! Oh. And what another drop kick by B Dog. How's the cowards on feeling? Oh! Right to the face! One, two, and a kick out. He's not thinking any good ideas. No, 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 don't do it, don't do it. He's fueling the fire. Yeah. 
to the head. Oh! Oh! You're next.
too much. Go. We'll get him back. And there you have it, EBW Universe. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes this week's episode of EBW Super Show. Please do me a favor, do us a favor, and please like, subscribe, favorite. Until we see you guys next time, thanks for watching.